Fuck off, it's my rank up game. Just fuck off. Win the coin toss. Nope, give me first, please. Watashi Wasta. I'm going second again. No problem. Ooh, no, not this game. Come on. This might ruin my win streak. He's going snake eyes. Oh, you fool. You fool. You should have went into Lancia. Fuck you, Labyrinth. Fuck you. So I let my subscribers tweak my Ice Barrier deck and this is what it looks like. This was what I was working with before. If you've watched my Ice Barrier deck profile video, this is the deck profile that I was talking about in that video with the combos and stuff. However, with the help of a few subscribers, specifically CD, shout out CD, we have got a new Ice Barrier deck and this is what it looks like. So after some tinkering with the old deck, some of the changes made to the deck, Effect Veiler, we have Defender now, we also have Spellbreaker and General Wayne. We have also removed the likes of Max C from the deck, a few other staples have been replaced, we've got Harpy's Feather Duster. We got Foolish Burial to pop off the Mirror Mage when we need to. We've added a few more Forbidden Droplets and Infinite Imperms, and that's about it. We were kind of capped on the budget. However, this deck is still really strong. If we take a look at the extra deck, a few changes you might notice is we have taken out some cards to replace with extra copies of Trisha Zero. Um, what else is different? We got Typhon. It's looking the same. There isn't a massive change in the extra deck. We have one extra copy of Trisha Le Zero Dragon. This deck has been working amazingly so far. And as proof, I will show to you what it has done in the gold ranks for me so far. We are now on a nine win streak with this deck. Let's take this new deck that you guys have made for me into ranked and see if we could actually hit platinum finally. Oh yes. Oh yes. We love when we win those coin tosses. We are definitely going first. Let's see what we're working with. A good hand, a good hand. Uh, how can we make this work? If we go straight into, I don't have Revealer, that's the problem. So I think I'm going to Medallion into Revealer. I want to Revealer. Yep, so we could start off by playing Revealer because I need Revealer in the graveyard to be able to use Spellbreaker's effect. So I lock him in second turn. Is there a Rage Crit straight away? When he saw Revealer, he was like, nah, I'm out. Fuck that. The opponent makes you wait when, the, when it's my turn. Oh, never mind. He saw Ice Barrier and he quit apparently. My guy saw a revealer and he was like, nope, I can't be asked. Another win? Nope, okay. He gave me second. Going second with Ice Barrier can be hard against certain decks. Not a bad hand, not a bad hand. We have Effect Veil and Called by the Grave. Oh no, King Sarcophagus. Is he playing Horus? Yep, he's playing Horus. Not a game we haven't won before, but going second against this deck can be problematic. He plays Foolish Burial. Yep. And then he sends my guy, Dome Tooth, Blessing of Horus, which he's going to obviously summon straight away. Well, that, that, you can't, okay, just play one spell card and then summon two cards onto the field. All right, let's see, three cards onto the field. Never mind. All right, we got a medallion. Let's see how we're going to pop off. I think it's the same combo as last time. We're going to go into Revealer. We have wins already. So let's add Revealer into my hand. We are going to discard. Couldn't discard wins. Since it has a graveyard effect as well. So we'll discard wins. A special summon Hexer. Kind of forgetting what I'm doing. We're going to special summon Hexer. Use Hexer's effect. Oh, fuck. Wait, we have to discard again, right? No, no, no. Okay, we don't have to discard again. What am I doing? Yep. And then from here, we're going to get... General Wayne. But we can't get wins, can we? I don't think we can. Let's see. Yep. Uh, freezing Chains might be the play here. And then I could go into Anemone using Revealer and Hexa. As long as he doesn't have any negates, it's fine by me. We're going to bring back Magic the Gathering. We're going to pop off Nemo's home. Yep, summon uh, my cards. Now I'm just thinking how I'm going to get rid of all his monsters. A Trishula Zero would be great, which I can right now. And I think that's what we're going to do. Wait, we're going for OTK. That's what we're doing. So we're going to banish all his monsters. And then if I freeze in chains, who do I bring back is the question. But first we're going to go into... No, 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 no. First I need to play with something else so let's freeze in chains so we're gonna get mirror mage back let's get a dragite 
No, no, no. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. Gorgeous is gonna summon anyway. So we go yes, and a Lancia right now. If I could bring back anyone, yep. And an Inter Lancia, and it should be an OTK. Chengling would have worked as well. I think he's disconnected after he realized what I've done. And then, yep, no need to pop it off. This should be OTK. Yep, it's going through as well. Nice turn to OTK. I've gotten used to this deck. Don't test me, Horace, bro. Win the coin toss. Nope, give me first, please. Watashi Wasta. I'm going second again. No problem, no problem. All right, let's see what we're dealing with here. Let's see, let's see. One Diabell star. Ooh. Ooh. Hmm. One for one. Okay. Ooh. No. Not this game. Come on. This might ruin my win streak. He's going snake eyes. As Thierry Henry would say. He's cooking. I can see what they're doing. What he's doing. I can see it. I feel it. I can. I can. He's cooking. Now he has two Flamber Dragons. Oh, he got rid of one. To get Salomon Great. Sunlight Wolf, what is he doing? He's cooking. It's my turn, but what did he do? I don't know what he did. Raiho isn't gonna help. Let's just go. Fucking revealer, fuck it. We're going. Ah, shit. Oh, that's fine. I mean, that's that's the same effect as Snake Eyes Flamberg Dragon. Oh, you're gonna add a card to your hand. I feel like he's reaching, though. This doesn't look like a strong board at all. Or am I just delusional? Probably the latter. Come on, the longer you take, the more I have to edit, my guy. Oh. A Palooza? Wait, what? Oh, he's still special summoning. It's my turn! You know how much I hate this. I always talk about this. Why is my guy doing stuff on my turn? They're good. Add them to your hand. Because he's going to negate a Palooza, obviously. But I still have a workaround. Let's discard Hexa. Or Raiho. Raiho isn't really effective. Okay, there we go. So that's what I was expecting. Which is absolutely fine. Then we're going to use Medallion to get Gorgeous. Oh, wait. Do I get Gorgeous? Let's see. Oh, fuck off with your Maxi, man. This is only going to bring me Lancia. That's the problem. No, it's not. Oh, hold on. Uh, is he going to negate it again? That's the problem because he's going to keep negating. Isn't a Palooza banned? You can't. If I can't do anything, I'll play into Typhoon. I'm gonna... Oh my god. He could just do that? And then he summons it as well. Uh, <laughs> and the fact that we didn't win the coin toss as well. If we won the coin toss and went first, this wouldn't be happening. None of this would be happening. He wouldn't be able to play any of these cards. That's why they banned a Palooza. I was like, why are they hitting a Palooza? It's not even that deep. Like, it was in my Tri Brigade deck and it wasn't doing anything for me. But this is out of, like, it's, it's stupid. I wasn't able to play anything. He has all these things that he could play in my turn. It doesn't even matter if I imperm at the moment. I don't know why he's still going. Bro, all you have to do is attack and it's over. Wait, let's see. 3,000, 2,800, 2,500. Yeah, it's over. GG's. I'm not even going to wait for him to do it because he takes way too long. And the longer it takes, the more editing it is for me. And I don't want that. What's this hand looking like? It's not looking too bad. So I could have went Medallion into Revealer. Used Revealer to send Mirror Mage. You know, actually, we can still do that. I don't know what I'm talking about. He doesn't have anything to stop me by the looks of it. We Revealer... Send Mirror Mage, summon Gorgeous, use Mirror Mage. You know, you know how it works. Yep. And it's gonna be like, do you want a special summon? Yes, please. Thank you. Bang. Yes, and then yes. This is one of the combos I learned from CD. Shout out CD once again. We get Lil Wayne into the hand, and then we use Gorgeous to summon Lil Wayne. Bada boom, bada bing. Yes, thank you. And then General Wayne is going to activate to get wins. And we use wins on Wayne. To get Spellbreaker. Onto the field. Yep. Yeah, we have extenders. So what we're going to do is. 
We're going to go into Lancia. Then we're going to special summon Speaker, use Freeze and Chains, pop Speaker with um, Mirror Mage. I don't know why I'm like explaining it to you guys instead of doing it. Like, Let me just show you what I'm going to do here. So activate effect, bring out Speaker. Yes, please. Thank you. Play Freeze and Chains. Oh, hold on a second. Do I have enough space? We're going to find out. Yeah, we do. Okay, nice. No problem, no problem. We're going to pop you. This is a really strong board for first turn board, by the way. Because he's not going to be able to play spells due to Spellbreaker. And also, we might... Uh, let's see what we're going to go into. Second turn, so I think we're going to go into... Dragite for another negate. Or we might just go into Croco for more draws. I think that's what we're going to do, yes. Activate Speaker. So we get more cards in our hands as well. This is like one of the most efficient starts that we could have. Uh, we're going to go into... Where are you? There you go. Activate Coco Pops effect and Coral Dragon's effect as well. There we go. That's Medallion. And Ice Jade. Run. Oh my god. This is disgusting. <laughs> this is disgusting. Hold on. We keep going, baby. We're going to get uh, Aubergine onto the field since it's going to be on the gate for next turn. I can keep playing, but there's no point. So we keep these cards in our hand for next, next turn. We activate effect now. And then we send Revealer from the graveyard to the Banish Zone. So he can't play no spell cards anymore. We should have set before then. I think set cards are still playable, but it is what it is. Oh, never mind. I was just about to end turn and he gave up. Um... Yeah, I feel bad. Win the coin toss, please. Oh, come on. Not in my rank up game. Don't do this to me, man. Give me first. Yes, suicide is your option. Is this the one? Ugh. Ugh, brother. Ugh, what is that hand? Brother, ugh. What's that? Thankfully. Thankfully, we have two medallions. So if he ashes it, we could medallion again. Yes. Thank God. Otherwise, we were screwed. <laughs> and thank fuck it's not once per turn. But who are we medallioning into this time? Because we need to play it well. We need to go with Hexa. Definitely going to have to play Hexa. Okay, he has no more hand traps. At least we know that. So that means no imperms, no forbiddens. Uh, no ashes, no effect failures. But yeah. Do I have freezing chains? I need freezing chains. What am I doing? Okay, good thing I stopped myself. Otherwise, I was screwed. This is my rank up game. I need to play like a plat to get to plat. I mean, I could just pop it off here. If I get Coral Dragon, I get a free draw. Just one card. I need this pool to be goated. I need to top deck so hard right now. Somehow. I don't even know what what I would draw to actually pop off. Let's see. Ice Shade, you see, that was a good card until it wasn't. It sucks so hard that on our rank up game we get a hand like this and we he gets he gives us the option to go first as well. We have Drollin Lockbird, we have Ash Blossom. But apart from that, Ancient Gear Golem. Ash this. So we keep the negate for another card. But since he's playing spell cards, he must have bricked like me as well. Hopefully. Was that his normal summon? No, it was a special summon. It is an ancient gear deck. From your deck to your hand, except... Yeah, we don't want that happening. Two cards is a bit too much. If you got one card, we would have drawled it. But two cards... Uh, not so much. And now he has a normal summon, so I think he's gonna normal summon. Ooh. Eee, that's a big yikes for both of us, I think. He's risking it. Oh no, he got rid of it so we could play Gear Town. Ah, he got rid of it to play spells. This is so unlucky, man. So unlucky. I think we could still turn this around, though. And of course, he brings back Ancient Gear Golem. Ah. When you draw, no. No. It's not going to matter. 
He's gonna play it. Yep, there we go. Chaos Gear Giant. Wow, nice. Your opponent cannot activate monsters. Hmm. Medallion is a shout. Yes. Okay. We've got the play. We've got the play. We're going to Chengying from here. There isn't anything else I could do. We're going to have to activate Ice Jade Runs. Aubergine's effect. Send Speaker to the graveyard. Summon. He can't stop my summon. Yes. Okay. Medallion draw was goaded, by the way. We're going to go into Chengying. Summon Chengying in attack position. Come on, Chandi. Come on, Chandi. Why, why can't I activate Speaker? I need to control an Ice Barrier monster for that. Oh, come on, man. I thought I was cooking. If I had another Ice Barrier monster on the field, we would we would have been cooking. Unfortunately, nope. This makes things problem. Oh, you fool. You fool. You should have went into Lancia. Attacked his monster and then killed Lancia off. No. I could have won. Because if I, if I sacrifice Lancia, I summon Trisha to zero. And he's going to another one. That's GG. Give me one more turn, blood. Give me one more turn. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I threw that so hard. I bet people watching were like screaming, go Lancia, go Lancia. We're going to rank up this episode, I promise. We win this coin toss, we get a good hand. Why is everyone using Dragon Maid? Oh, also, Harpy's Feather Duster. The game actually wants me to rank up now. Oh, Labyrinth. Against Labyrinth? Now, I know Labyrinths do this. But I don't know if they have any spell negates. So, one way to find out is play Medallion first. What was that card's effect? Okay, it's back in his hand. Bro, what's going on? Stop doing stuff, it's my turn now. I thought you were just meant to set a back row and just leave it. And now you're going to special summon that as well. Okay. Oh. Maybe not. He's activating the effect. He's going to look at my hand. No. <laughs> fuck off. It's my rank up game. Just fuck off. I can't be asked. I can't be asked. Why am I going second? And in my draw turn, he gets rid of all my spell cards. What is this dex, man? For real. Now I'm going to summon this. Watch. Watch what happens. I put a harpies in there to get rid of traps because it was pissing me off. And now this guy does this. We're not going to get to a plat this episode, guys. <laughs> hey, Imperm. It doesn't matter. But we still get Mirror Mage's effect off, which is fine. I don't think I could play spells. Because I think... Oh, so I'm not even going to be able to get any spell cards in my hand for the next three turns. Which is kind of annoying. What have you still got? A Dragite is looking mighty fine right now, I'm not going to lie. I mean, he's run out of cards in his hand, but I think he can still use cards in the graveyard. Come on, Ice Barriers, man. Come on, Ice Barriers. So we're just going to go for the draw. Going to go into Dragite. That's going to get destroyed. Yep, let's get rid of this guy. And then just end phase. Okay, what are you playing now? No, he's going to straight up special summon something. So let's negate that shit. Fuck that. No? Okay. So we stop him from doing that and destroy it. Pretty sus. Okay, let's hope he can't do anything. He can't. But it, when it's my turn, he's going to start activating a bunch of shit. I have reveal in the hand, so we have hopes. Forbidden Droplet is going to get fucked. I've been drawing spell cards for the past three turns. What is this luck? Are you going to let me play? Thank you. Now, if you try 
set whatever the fuck that is. I'm going to fuck you up. Wait, I can't even... Oh, yes. I have Revealer in the graveyard. I'm going to special summon. Oh, looks like the tides are turning. Looks like the tides are turning. Yes! Let's go! Fuck you, Labyrinth! Fuck you! Guess who's plat? Piece of shit! Look at this, look at this! Ah, let's go! Draw the line!